Today's tip and trick is verbal bullying. Verbal bullying can be caught by harassment laws, but suppose employees do it in writing. What does the Court of Appeal say about this type of behaviour? Some years ago, the House of Lords, as it was back then, confirmed the Protection from Harassment Act 1997 could be used against employees, against not only their colleagues, but their employers as well. As this particular law was originally designed to combat stalkers, this was bad news. At that time, the Lordships ruled that 1. The Harassment Act covers any form of verbal harassment. 2. An employee need only show they've suffered two incidents of anxiety or stress caused by their employer. 3. There's no statutory defence available to a harassment claim. And 4. Employees have six years to bring a claim against you. So. What can we learn? Well, managers and staff should be made fully aware of the implications of this case. Instruct them not to make oppressive and unacceptable comments in written communications. Letters, email and text messages. Otherwise, it's you, as the employer, who will be left to pick up the pieces. Make it clear in your equal opportunities and dignity at work policy that any breaches of this rule will result in immediate disciplinary action. And that's our top tip for today. Thanks for watching thebusiness.com.